What's happening, Magnusites? Just woke up, so I may a little be a little bit swollen in the face. But don't worry about that. We're going to get through this. All right, so Magnus Answers. Here's what he wrote. The show's name is Magnus Answers. It's my section of my shit. He and his name ain't Magnus Answers. Just, anyway, okay. I need your help, Magnus. The girl that I consider the one says she loves me, but she loves another dude too. How can I get her to see that I'm better than him? He's a straight up douchebag, but she still loves him. Let me tell you something. Damn, that is a huge flock of geese. Ah, damn. Hope ain't no tidal wave coming. Y'all remember in Final Destination? I think it was something, not Final Destination, that ain't Final Destination. The one with the comet, double impact, nah, it's a fan damn movie. Sudden impact, uh, whatever. Y'all know what I'm talking about. Where well, the comet was coming, I think animals was running and shit when the tidal wave was coming. Cause they, anyway, I'm sorry, that's, that's some different shit. But listen, okay, so that question that you asked is a, a timeless, ageless question. It's one of those things that young guys get into. I get a feeling that you're younger than me. I don't think you're my age because by this time, usually we've gotten rid of that. We'll, we won't ask another guy that question because here's the thing. The majority of the time, we're like, well, bitch, if you in love with him, what the fuck are you doing messing with me? See, you didn't give me enough details in your 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 you know your email to let me know exactly what's going on so I can figure this out for you. But... I'm thinking there's a couple of scenarios going on. First of all, like I said, I think you're younger than me. And maybe uh, she's right, involved. Sorry about that, y'all. Um, my camera was full to the brim, so it cut off. It was all full of magnetisms and magnus knowledge. So I had to delete all that shit. This is what I was saying. Okay, so there's a few different scenarios that's probably going on. Either you're you're kind of seeing her on the side and she's still with him and she says she loves you, but she also loves him. So, I mean, eh, I mean, I wouldn't have got involved in, in that type of situation anyway with a girl that's got a man because it's, it's, you know, usually only going to bring, it's going to bring somebody heartbreak or get somebody fucked up. One of the two, a lot of the time. Sometimes you get away scot-free, but I'm just saying. But if it's that type of situation, I would leave her alone. I mean, you said he's a debt to her. She's a, he's a douchebag. So, I mean, you know, how can you get her to see that you're the better man? She should have seen that by now. You got what I'm saying? Like, just, just no way you should be sitting here like, what should I do to get her? I mean, you know what I'm saying? Like, you know, and I'm not coming down on you, but real men don't play that shit. You know, we don't. It's kind of like, nah. No, I mean, real men would rather see women fighting over them than them fighting over a woman. You get what I'm saying? Not that it should be like that on either side, but I'm just saying. If I was you personally, I mean, I, I, I would get rid of her. You know, that's a lot of times is the way to show them who is the better man. Think about that for a second. You withdraw yourself from the situation. She has no more contact with you. Don't text her. Don't call her. None of that shit. Like, look, this is too much for me. I can tell that you're drawn, you know, that you're you're torn between us. So you need to make this decision. You need to make this decision. So I'm gonna I'm gonna step out and let you figure out what you really want. Nine times out of ten, she's gonna figure out real fast, okay? She's either gonna stay with him or she's gonna leave him for you. And uh, I think that's what you should do. Um, you know, I was thinking about going down a few other different scenarios, but, you know, it's it's really is that simple. I mean, she needs to make the decision. It's not about seeing, you know, like, why you're the gra the best. If she's in love with, first of all, why is she in love with both of you? You know what I mean? I, I know this happens, but, you know, like, I've only loved one woman at a time. I've never loved two at a time. The only way I can end up loving two at a time well, I mean, it can happen. Like, say she broke, like, I say I broke up with somebody. And then a few months later, I meet another girl and end up loving her. Then I run into my ex and I'm like, oh, man, I saw her. I realized I still loved her. Okay, I understand. But you make it sound like she's still with this guy. If she's still with him, 
Why is she in, why is she in love with you? What the fuck's going on? The fact of the matter is, you need to put the ball in her court. You need to move along and get yourself some female friends. You know what I mean? And you know, for, now I'll make her jealous, and that'll make the real shit come out. You make somebody jealous, that make the real shit come out. You they, they they'll let you know if they really care about you or not. So. Um, that's all I got to say, man. That, that's that's how I think you can find out, you know. Or ask her straight up, like don't beat around the bush. Like one thing you learn when you get older, don't beat around the bush. You let her know. You say, look, um, you tell me you love me, but you love him too. Well, you mean to make a motherfucking decision, okay? I'm fucking Tyrone Magnus. I mean, whatever your name is, you insert the words. And I don't play that shit. You understand? Okay? I got 5,000 other bitches out there. But I'm choosing to be with you. So which one you want to pick? Hmm? 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 Let me call the other bitch. Let me call the other bitches right now. I could call every single one of them. Cindy. Carol. La Laquisha. Leticia. Tawanda. Uh, Patricia. Kelly. Smelly. You know, all of them. So you let her know. You know what I'm saying? You got to make it look like you don't give a fuck. You need to be out. Because once she knows that you weakened by the thought of her being with him, she knows she can dangle you on the line. Dangle you for as long as she needs you emotionally or whatever it is that you're giving her until she figures out what she wants to do. You want to be in control of this situation because she's got two men coming at her when you making it sound like right now, basically, you don't got no other options. You just want her. All right, hope this is sinking in, brother. All right, if you got any more questions, hit me up, okay? Otherwise, I'll talk to y'all later.